Jermaine Defoe married his fiancée Donna Tierney in a lavish wedding ceremony earlier this month, with the couple having enjoyed a three-day celebration of their union. The former footballer, 39, wed the beauty therapist at picturesque country house Cliveden House in Berkshire, surrounded by 360 guests including the bride's daughter. The groom, who has played for the England national team during his career, and the bride have opened up about their wedding, describing it as having been like a movie. The newlyweds, who have known each other for several years, but only began dating in around 2019, shared details of their nuptials with OK. Following their special ceremony. Do you enjoy reading about celebrities? Sign up for all the best celeb news from the mirror here. Donna wore a bespoke laced sleeved regal gown, which had been eight months in the making. It's understood to have been by Anna Sarinogo of Eleganza Sposa in Glasgow. I wanted something regal, something elegant that shows off my shape. And something with long sleeves, because your mane likes long sleeves, she explained to the outlet. The designer, based in Donna's native Scotland, also worked on dresses for her daughter Olivia, 12 who was her maid of honor, along with her sister Charlene. Your main opted for a three-piece suit with an off-white tuxedo and waistcoat, by Moadas at Signature Bespoke. His best men were his cousin, Stefan, and his friend Ryan. Donna was accompanied down the aisle by her father, Charlie, with her grandfather's favorite song, What a Wonderful World by Louis Armstrong, playing for them. Your main commented, When I turned around and saw her from a distance, my eyes just started welling up. I tried to compose myself, but am an emotional person anyway. He recalled that as she approached, it was a special moment. He said that he held her hand and noticed her shaking. Donna he calmed her, adding, it was so special. The couple exchanged traditional vows and custom-made rings, with his made of white gold and platinum with two diamonds, whilst her wedding band was emerald cut. The couple's celebrations had begun prior to the nuptials though, with a barbecue on a 376-acre property the day before, which was the first time that their families had ever met. Your main and his groomsmen stayed in a cottage near to a lake on the estate prior to the wedding, with Donna having spent the night in the main hotel with her attendants. Cliveden House, where such celebrations took place, is said to be the same venue where Meghan Markle had spent the night before her wedding to Prince Harry back in 2018. Following the nuptials, a reception was held inside a glass orangery marquee, which included delphinum chandeliers. There was a six-year wedding cake waiting for guests. The wedding reception saw guests serenaded by bagpipes, in honor of Donna's Scottish roots, and later entertained by a steel band in a nod to Germain's Caribbean heritage. Guests including Germain's football pals Ledley King, Carlton Cole, Sean Wright Phillips and Leon Knight enjoyed a four-course meal, which included chicken Kiev and a tart tauton. The newlyweds' first dance was to Luther Vandross always and forever. It was just a little two-step. We danced until halfway through, then, I asked everyone to join us, your main said. His speech during the celebrations is said to have brought tears to guests' eyes, with your main saying, I didn't even write anything down because when you know how you feel it comes from the heart. Donna said, the bit that got me was when he spoke about my daughter. That made me feel extra special. Olivia, loves your main so much, has such a good stepdad. There was also a special mention of Germain's stepfather, 
Andre, who came into his life when he was seven. Has credited as having been a role model for the groom. Guests were later treated to a display by fire eaters and flamethrowers at the after party, with a Caribbean buffet available at midnight and the marquee became a nightclub. Your main said the music stopped at 4 a.m. but guests headed to the lobby of the main building, as nobody wanted to go home, though the couple retired to bed themselves. The celebrations weren't over though because after a couple of hours sleep, your main and Donna closed their three-day event by hosting tea for their guests at the venue. The couple, who met years ago but reconnection through social media in 2019, when he relocated to Scottish Team Rangers, had a romantic honeymoon in the Maldives. Their wedding came after he proposed last year in a penthouse at Blythswood Square Hotel in Glasgow, with heart-shaped balloons, Marry Me written in lights and rose petals. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at Web Celebs at Mirror. Co.uk or call us direct 0207 29